How's it going guys? Small Master here. We're back with some more Pokemon. Let's go Pikachu. Gosh dang it. Now, before we get started, we have a man to talk to because, uh... I feel lied to. I feel lied to. I feel so lied to. I thought I was gonna get an Arcanine to ride on. No! I got a Persian! I feel lied to, Chief. I 1000% feel lied to. <laughs> How? How does this happen? Hello, and welcome back to the show. If something can go wrong, it can. When a cute scratch cat Pokemon Meowth evolves, it looks like this. Oh ho, it's cuter than ever. Persian is the best. Hmm? Why did you think catching pup Pokemon and I give you a scratch cat Pokemon? Because I wanted to see if your presence would stay the same. Ah, that's seeing so many Growlithe. Ah, you're a dick. That's what you are. You see this Pikachu tail wag? No, you're a dick. There's an item over here. Hold up. Wait. Item. It's wag. It's wag means there's an item. See? No wag. Wag. Where's the item? Where's the item? Where? Where is it? See? A Mega Mad. There's... Can I not get this without... Do I have to surf? I don't... I have to surf. I have to... I'll come back for that. I gotta remember that. There's an item right there. Pikachu, you deserve some rubs. I didn't mean to give you rubs, but you're getting rubs. No, not those kind of rubs. You like the belly rubs, right? And then you like these tail rubs. Oh, yeah, there you go. We're taking off this dumb sailor hat, because you look dumb with a sailor hat. Anyway... As I was saying before, my whole computer flipped out, and I had to turn it off and return it back on again. Jesus Christ. Um, freaking heckin'. I did an oopsie. A big gosh darn oopsie. Now, maybe think, what oopsie could have you possibly have done? I meant to take off the hat, dog. There we go. Uh, so I'm playing this on my Let's Play account. What I didn't realize is that my Nintendo Switch account is on my main account, right? And because of that, I cannot connect the internet with this account unless I make another tw Nintendo Switch account. Which you should have too anyway, but you know, having the money to pay for Nintendo Online for two accounts, come on now, I don't have that. But I mean, in theory, I could do it. So... I was going to do this, but then it was just like, I'm going to change up my team anyway. But in bringing of this, that suddenly meant that for Jafar, Jafar could no longer evolve. So I was like, all right, is there another way to get an Alakazam? And there was, it was to get uh, an Alakazam on one of the routes. Uh, I forgot what route it was, but I remember which, I think it's 105? To say, or no, no, it's not 105, it's Route 5. It's Route 5. Route 5, there's a 5% chance to that an Alakazam will appear. And every time I try to get one, my catch combo would break with the Growlips, or something other bullshit would happen, and that leads to the team that we have now. So we got everybody kind of a little over-leveled and leveled up. So we have Cello here, we have our gosh darn Cheese Stick. Cello learned Heat Wave, Cheese Stick got Thunderbolt. Uh... It didn't really do much. It's just level 32, so we'll get a Pidgeot faster now. Uh, this boy right here learned Nightshade. Shane? Learned Nightshade. We have Gosh Darn War Turtle that learned Water Gun for some reason. Finally learning Water Gun. Freaking Bubba evolved into Venusaur. Gosh dang it. So we now have a Venusaur instead of an Ivysaur. And that's our squad now. It's just, it's just, we got, we got a big boy, big boy Venusaur over here. He is a big boy. Wait, hold on. There's something I have to try. Yes. 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 This is, this is perfect. Look at him jump. Look at him go. Oh yes, this is what I wanted. He's like a frog. It looks so weird, but it's great. He's actually kind of smaller than I thought he would be. Like, in all actuality, he's really, like, he's big. But he's also, like, I thought Venusaur would be bigger than this. 
I really, really did. Um, either way, though, we have two things to do in this episode. One is fight the gym, but the other one is to fight Mira, and I thought, what well, would be a great way to start the episode instead of fighting uh, Lieutenant Surge? Uh, because we have to do a gym puzzle and all that. Let's go ahead and just start with the... you going to catch up, Vita Sora? There you go. There, there it is. There, there we go. All right, let's do it. Aw, oh, well, shoot. Oh, look at those waves on those rocks. I don't like that. I don't like that. I was so caught up in sketching the ocean view here, I guess I missed my ship. Uh, what are you gonna do? Hmm. I guess I'll stay here for a bit if that's the case. I really like the color of the Canto Sea anyway. Wait, aren't you supposed to... How about a Cantonian trainer? Do you want to try battling my fairy type Pokemon? Yes, I do! Alright, here I go. You're going to learn how we get fairy how great fairy type Pokemon can be! Oh boy! I'm so excited! They're so totally not broken, which I mean they are, but they're not. Like the game's I think that with the addition of fairy type, it broke the game in 6th gen and 7th gen, respectively. Like, wow. But in all in all hindsight, like they're still leveled out. It gave poison another reason to exist. Because, I mean, most grass types are pretty much grass poison. Especially in Gen 1. So, in this game, definitely gives a reason for poison types to exist. Same with steel. Because, like, I mean, steel kind of beats ice. But, I mean, you would usually use fire in a steel type. So, yeah. But, I mean, like... Where was it going with that? What else would you use steel on other than being defensive? Like, it's just, I don't know. It's, you have it for fairy types now. That's, that was the point I was trying to make. I'm gonna flamethrower this Jigglypuff. <laughs> oh my goodness. So I pretty much, I don't know what happened with my laptop just now, but I set this keyboard on top of here because it was eating, and this is my eating spot, and this keyboard's in the way, it's for this other, my desktop. And it just, I couldn't type, so I had to turn it off. Jigglypuff died! Alright, we burned it and it died, alright? I don't know what you want. This is just how it is. Mr. Mime? Alright, let's go, buddy. Let's see what, what we're doing here. Uh, I want to use our newly evolved Venusaur. You know what? Bubba is out here, ready to do the gosh darn thing. I forgot if you were a male or a female, so that's why I was hesitant. He is out here ready to do the gosh darn thing. You are a male. Get Petal Dance. We are way over leveled. Oh my gosh. See, I didn't mean to act. I did. I actually accidentally over grinded. I didn't mean to actually grind. I was just. It was the whole point was to try to catch an Alakazam to replace Jafar with a better mod. But you know what? I guess that just didn't end up happening. So this is like. Can you get really? You know, Nintendo. I'd really appreciate if you make all your paths like the same. Like like. I'm looking at this, this is skinnier than this. I can understand why, because of perspective's sake. But like, make them all the same size. My thick boy here is having a hard time, all right? He's really having a hard time. He's trying his best, okay, man? He's really trying his best. Yeah, this is, uh, we gotta use Chop Down, all right. Okay, buddy. I think that Pikachu you have will have no trouble slicing through it. Come on, give it a shot. Oh boy, I'm sliding through it. With my slur, because I can't speak. I'm sorry if that's offensive, but, uh, no, that's just how it be. Great work. You chopped down the troublesome tree and opened the way to the gym, and that means the gym challenge will now be waiting here. Is that the only requirement for doing this gym, or do I have to show him a ground type? If I have to show him a ground type? Oh, boy, we're gonna have words. So originally, uh, everyone thought that the puzzle would be ruined by the red and the blue trash can. So I have no idea what their uses are. Like, 100%. No idea what this does. It's just a red trash can. And it's a blue trash can. They have no significance to anything. They're just there. So that's why it makes no sense. That this, that, that is, that it's like that. It just doesn't. It just literally does not. And there's only trash. I was trying to click on the trash can, sir. You interrupted my conversation with my household, alright? Which is the trash, this is where I belong. I just need you to understand that. 
okay? Magnemite! Ho! Oh, let me tell you about Magnemite, all right? These pose no threat to me and my gosh darn Solo. Come on, Solo, let's go. Heat, heat wave it up, dog. Heat wave it up. Get the heckles out of here. I don't know why I'm putting such emphasis into this. I'm just overly hyped to take on a gym today. I'm just ready. I'm just ready to go. I'm ready to do this. I'm ready for Persians to be used, I guess. I don't know. I'm not using the Persian. I don't need to use the Persian. It's just not something I... Oh, okay. So, I have a 50-50 chance of doing this, and I think... I did it! Yeah! I will say, I, I did this, like, instantly, and you would think, yeah, the puzzle's easier now, because it's, like, for kids and people getting into the game. I guarantee it's probably not easier at all. And the red and blue trash cans are just there just to eliminate two of the trash cans and some of the annoyings. Also, what is Lieutenant Surge doing with all these trash cans and red and blue barrels in here? Like, are they supposed to be, like, electricity thingies? Or what's what's going on? I'm so confused about that part. Like, why, why is he collecting these? I mean, if he's trying to clean up the community, I guess he's doing a great job. But don't those, doesn't the community need all these trash cans? I just, I mean, this just, just might be my opinion, but I mean, I, I think... I think that they need the trash cans. Uh, it might just be me. Okay. You know, I didn't ask to be Thunderwave to Pikachu, but you know what? You did it anyway, and you seemed real smug about it, so I just watch. All right. Wow, imagine paralyzing, and then getting paralyzed. Whoa, this is, this is one wacky let's play today, boys. Oh, boy. Getting quick attack paralyzation over here. Ah, oh, guess what? Your mod is dead! What'd you get? I'm so violent. I don't know why. I don't know what's wrong with me today. I'm just... I'm very... Very just get out of my way. Right? I don't need this shizow in my life right now. Okay, let's go to a bag. I'm pretty sure in my medicine pocket. Yeah, there it is. There's the boys. There's the boys right there. All right, buddy, old putty, old shoppity do, old pal. Let's get her going. Oh, that's my neck. That is my neck. I threw her back. And, oh boy, I did not want to feel that one. Oh, no sirree. That was a neck cramp that I was not in the feeling for. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Not a one! Not a one right there! Wow! That legitimately was painful. I felt like my neck just collapsed on itself and then re straightened. Ow! I don't know why. I have I've been I've had neck problems in the past. Uh it hasn't been that serious. Why do these numbers keep calling me, guys? Oh my goodness. I hate spam call. Spam call is the most annoying thing in the world. It's not even like job places calling me or anything, which I apply to like almost every day. It's literally just spam calls. It's so annoying. It's so obnoxious. I know I've talked about it before. Just, ugh. Ugh. I'm disgusting. I love how he, sh he shouts into his megaphone and his Pokemon. It's hurting his Pokemon ears. That's abuse! Voltorb, use blow up! Blow yourself up for my own amusement! Yell it into the microphone. Blow up! He said fired? I don't know what he said just there. I mean, yeah. Sure. Whatever. You do you, bro. Uh, if you wanna if you wanna just get fired like that, you you have that. That's, you you get that! You get that job promotion, man. You you do you. I hope you succeed in the, the best way possible. I'm gonna fight Lieutenant Surge. I don't know where I was going with this. Hey, buddy, how's it going? That's a smug boy's face. I tell you what, this is a great thumbnail. We've been going with people in the thumbnails for so long now, and we're still doing it. We're still going. There hasn't been any Pokemon. Well, you look like a pint-sized challenger. Ha ha ha! Ah, you got big brassy nerves to take me on pu with your puny power. A Pokemon battle is a war. I'll show you, civilian. I'll, t I'll shock you into surrender. I, uh, messed up there on purpose. You 
challenge GM leader, Lieutenant Surge. Sent out Voltorb. Let me tell you, we're gonna start pushing this series out, and uh, these Voltorbs, not gonna be a part of it. Maybe asking yourself, is that Vortorbism? That's a light screen though, and I'm not appreciative. Why? Because now he's gonna live this flamethrower. Oh, he eats that. He eats that so well. Why does he eat that so well? That thunderbolt's gonna hurt. Ooh, that thunderbolt does hurt. Can I get a burn? I mean, I know it's not gonna stop my demise, but just like, ow! Could you not thunderbolt again? And you're thunderbolting again. That really hurts, you know. I just, I just want you. I just need you to understand that, like, no, don't do that. That's painful. <laughs> I'll have to send out Magnemite. Of course he is. Sure, I'll keep battling. I'm gonna waste a light stream turn. See, this is how you do it in Wi-Fi, right? You just use the super potion. Totally how you get it done. Oh my gosh, my ear just got all itchy. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's on the inside. That's sick. Oh, that's gonna. Is that gonna do a lot of damage? Oh. Oh. Of course. Of course, it's gonna do a lot of damage. <laughs> oh, man. I may or may have not underestimated Lieutenant Surge in this one. Oh, boy. Oh, man. I'm gonna have to leech seed and heal up Growlithe real good. Maybe I should have grinded up more because he is doing some damage with this Thunderbolt and this Magnemite. My god. Like, actually, jeez, dude. Alright, I'm gonna Leech Seed you. Get oh! Oh! He avoids the attack! He can avoid my Leech Seed, but I can't avoid his Thunderbolt? Mm, that seems fair. Keep hurting my neck. I'm gonna go back. I need to not lean backwards right here. Freaking is probably not a smart thing to do. It's just slowly racking up that damage, but I'm getting this Leech Seed gang up in here. What you know. Alright, so let's try this again, Gralo. Alright, I know you're not a ground type, okay? And I know you're not specify in this field, but I really need you to do the gosh darn thing right now against this Magnemite. Just for the pure fact that you're the only one that can really touch it. I mean, like, yeah, I can sit down like War Turtle and he can get bodied by Thunderbolt, but I just don't think you know, I just don't think that's the that's the play today, but no. I just uh Yeah, no, I just don't uh, just don't think that's the play that we uh, should be doing here, ladies and gentlemen. I uh I think that uh, we should be trying to get our best in uh, this great American society. Yep. Uh... Oh, and uh, Bubba is paralyzed. Ew. Oh, man. Uh, what a bit of fortunate and uh, uh, turbid events. Uh, we're going to have to heal Bubba uh, real quick. We'll do, a, we'll do a real quick heal here. Uh, real quick. Uh, cool whip with the uh, real quick. Uh, right, let's throw in a super potion here and uh, get, her, get her going, get her real going up in here. Yep, here we go. See, the real strat is to, is to, is to wait for these Thunderbolts to end. Like, in all honesty, because my god. Can you stop Thunderbolting, my dude? See, now we just have the light screen up so I can outspeed him. That's what I was done. That's what I was doing. So we can go into solo. We'll eat a Thunderbolt, get the Leech Seed, hit a Flamethrower, and then he's dead! Big brain plays, dog. Big brain plays. Best Let's Player, alright. Okay, you know, potion spamming? I know I was asking for a crit. Oh! That did more than intended and expected. That did not heal enough. I really hope I outspeed right now. I should. It's a Magnemite. Yeah, you're slow as dick! Alrighty then. That's nice. That was enjoyable. Okay, Lieutenant Surge. What you got for me next? See, now I'm level 27. I will eat those Thunderbolts. Look at that plus one in special defense. Oh boy! Right you. Hmm. Only it was Alola. Now, I would have a Raichu Pikachu outmatch right now, but I 
feel like it's just not appropriate. Oh, wait. Okay, good. I was about to say, I didn't want to... I didn't want to choose Pikachu. I just wanted to look at him. I swear, father. Anyway, Venusaur was planned. All right, this wasn't planned to have a Venusaur in this battle, but I'm glad we do. Because, oh boy, he is dishing out some freaking damage with these mons, man. I need to start candying my mons. I guess that's what I'm going to start doing. I'm going to candy them in between episodes. Because, oh boy, look at his mons damage. Like, this Thunderbolt. Ah. I mean, that's not a lot. Well, ha. Should do less. It should do one point of damage, right, guys? Totally. How many turns am I gonna get paralyzed in a row? You know, I know I didn't. I know I should. I didn't heal it when I should have. But you know, I can at least not get paralyzed five. I'm waiting. I'm waiting, Venusaur. Do you want to move anytime today? You know, you're the star of the show today, buddy. You might make it on the thumbnail. But I need you to stop getting paralyzed. There we go. There it is. Ah, uh, yes. And now let the stall begin as I paralyze heal up my Venusaur and then go buy more at the department store. Oh my goodness, there we go. See, now that I can finally move, it's a miracle. Hmm, that's sucking the leech seed off this Raichu. Look at him. Floating right there. Smug smile. Well, I'll never evolve my Pika boy. I just almost tried to throw a Pokeball at this Raichu. I was legitimately about to go inside of my bag. Actually? That here and there is not the time to try this. Are you allowed? No, it only sends you okay, so it only sends you to your medicine pocket when you go to your bag. I was about to say, if I was allowed to try to throw a Pokeball at it. That would be a great throwback. Wow. I had to click one move, and I wasted all of that time during that entire battle. Yeah, seems legit. Fine, then. Take the Thunder Badge. Thunder Badge. Thunder Badge. I forgot how to say it properly, but you know what? It's fine. And that's not all. You're special, kid. Take this. Are you serious? I got a Lieutenant Surge autograph? Don't worry. That's not all I'm going to give you. I was about to say, wait. Are you serious? I got an autograph, but not a DM? What's going on here? It contains an electrified Thunderbolt. Teach it to Electro-type Pokemon with an extra shock value. You know what? I already got it. Oh my god, you're in pecking adorable ass adorable ass little little nugget. Oh no, no no I didn't mean to be mean to you. I didn't mean to be mean to you. Come over here. Come over here. Wanna, wanna high five you? Right. Ah what do it to the tail? Oh no. He's not he's not letting me do the high five with him right now. He's not letting him do it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, get that cuteness. Get that cuteness all out in here. He wants more attention? <gasps> oh, I made me a present! Ah! Oh, but give me Stardust Dog, you're the goat. The freaking goat, man. The freaking goat. Why are you just the goat? Freaking Pikachu, the goat over here. All right, where's this uh, Lieutenant Surge? Yeah, what's up with this autograph, Chief? No, I want to autograph uh, from uh, yeah. the autograph you got from Vermilion City, Le Vermilion City gym leader Lieutenant Surge. He wrote, "Good luck." All right, okay. I mean, I don't remember that. As I guess that was Nintendo just being like saluting to you, just like here, Lieutenant Surge is like a celebrity or something. I never thought of it that way, but if he's like a war hero, then I guess he would be kind of a celebrity. I never really thought about it that way. Oh, it's Misty! Hello! Oh, it's you again! 
Wow, you beat Lieutenant Surge? That must be pretty cool. Glad to see you're learning a thing or two and your Pokemon must be tried their best. I'm just getting free heals in this game. All right! Oh, me? I'm just going to go swim in the sea. There are times where I just want to break uh, free of the puny little pool back to the sw swim in the big blue. Where are you headed next? Oh, Diglett's Cave. It's pretty close by. If you haven't been, I, I could show you the way. Want a guide? I don't need no guide! Oh, well... That's some way to turn down such a nice offer. Do I have? All right. Yeah. Great. Okay, let's go. Oh, freaking boy. You know, I don't need your nice offer, but I'm going to take it just because you're just like so angry about it. Oh, it's Diglett's Cave. Well, the Diglett Dub a Pass closed on their own. Oh, pal, see you. Bye. I can, didn't need your help anyway, Misty. All right, I can get things done on my own. Okay, all right, bruh. All right, dog. I don't need your help. Oh my god. I genuinely do not know what's wrong with me sometimes. That's a diglet. All right, how many more diglets can we find in here? I saw one diglet. There's two diglets. There was. Well, give me a three. Give me a three dig. Where's another dig? Another dig boy? There are ah, there's a third dig boy! Oh! Is that a fourth dig boy? No, it wasn't a fourth dig boy. It was just the ground. It was a groundedy ground. Ah! It's a fifth dig boy! Oh no, that's the fourth dig boy. Wait, no. There's only four dig boys. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa, man. Whoa! All the dig boys! They're so diggity. Diggity do. And now we're on Route 2. Cool. Remember me? I'm one of Professor Soak's assistants. Ah, I'm glad I ran into you. Why don't I show you a neat trick? Uh, it's a little bright out here. Uh, I'll be waiting to show you inside. Uh, hold on. Uh, I gotta show you inside uh, this house right here. Uh, I'll be in there. Okay, that's a brass tricks. So I got something to show you. It's a secret technique called Light Up. Now let me turn off the lights and... There, nice and dark. Now calm your heart and take deep breath. You will be able to sense your surroundings no matter how dark it is. Oh, my eyes! They burn! You just didn't have to freaking pizzazz my eyes off. Thanks, man. Let's keep focus. Uh, then a keen focus spreads around me. You see here, I'll teach it to you too. Huh, if Pikachu wants to seem to learn instead. Yeah, it's called Flash! I don't already know the secret to the top shot. I see Professor Oak mentioned, but I didn't know I've seen that room. Pikachu's really special. Oh, it's fantastic. Let me try to teach it to you here, and let's light up the room again. Now, Pikachu, follow what I do. Calm your heart, breathe deeply, show your surroundings. I'm blinded again! Nintendo, what was the reason for you to put a white screen right in my eyeballs on my face while let's playing the game? You know, you didn't need to do that, but you did it. Wow, your Pikachu is really quite wonderful. Now use secret technique to your heart's content. Ah, since there are not any moves, you can use them even when your Pokemon have no energy out of battle. Oh, whoa! So I can get through Rock Tunnel if I use secret technique to light up. Do you know who Rock Tunnel is? Oh man, he's such a helpful kid, and I'm pretty sure the scientist has no idea who he is, and he's in this random house with the scientist. I'm just gonna leave, and everything's just fine and dandy in there. Yep, totally A-OK. -okay. I've been trying to end the episode. I'm just not allowed, apparently. Oh, hey, fool. Uh, did you learn to use light up from Professor Oak's assistant, too? What? You didn't, but Cheese Stick did. Oh, wow, your partner is really amazing, fool. You know what? I actually know some place where you might be able to use it. Want me to take you there? Let's see. I call hand holding, and I'm all for it, because that means I don't have to walk there in the next episode. All right, we'll get there right in time. Come on. I gotta go back for items, though, now. Ah, oh, okay, it wasn't that really hand holding. So just head east from Cerulean City, right in this direction. Got it? Just keep going, you'll eventually get in the system called Rock Tunnel. I hear it's pitch black, but if you use light up, you don't even have to be scared in the dark. See you around. 
See, what they should have done is you should have attacked along during the route, and then you could have done double battles and everything. But what do I know, Nintendo? What do I know about game design? Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this episode of our Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, let's play. Make sure to hit the like button down below. Lieutenant Surge looks so angry. Why are you so mad, bro? I don't understand. Either way, all of your masters, I'm Photomaster, and I'll see you guys later. And I've saved my progress. I'm out.